Yes, actually, I'm leading uh, one of the challenge, rice challenge initiative, um, uh, focusing on the on the drought. Rice is becoming very important crop in Africa, and uh, when you look at the country which are producing or consuming rice, um, the the production uh, it have been um, have been uh, reduced by a lot of constraint and drought is among one of the constraints that uh, we are facing in Africa. And so, um, through the project uh, I'm leading, uh, we, are, we are really using an innovative approach, which is the use of uh, biparental marker-assisted recurrence selection to tackle drought. You know, drought, because it's a complex trait, you have so many mechanisms of so many, um, uh, you have a physiological component, you have a genetic component, you have uh, also environmental component. So um, you really need to, to have uh, uh, all tools, necessary infrastructure, necessary tools to tackle that threat. And uh, through this, uh, this project, the Generation Challenge Program, were able to provide to us all the, the, the necessary infrastructure to, to measure the water, to measure um, the drought in the environment where you, you are. So in addition to that project, the Generation Challenge Program put in place an infrastructure project, which is very important. That project uh, 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 really helped to put in place, to buy the equipment, necessary equipment, necessary infrastructure needed to, to handle the drought uh, threat. So we put all those equipment in the field, in, the, in our partner country, and we develop uh, the population, uh, mass population, and those mass population have been phenotyped in different environments uh, first under uh, normal condition to see the yield potential of the population and then they are now being phenotyped also under drought condition and uh, by using a mass approach we hope that we'll be able to, to identify um, genetic region associated to drought and then to accumulate the favorable allele and um, develop a, a new line uh, that will uh, that the breed the farmer the breeder and the farmer will be using in the next uh, decade in Africa